hello everyone welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here you're welcome today i'd love to share with you this rice and beans recipe this easy beans and rice recipe is very easy to prepare once you get the technique it's very perfect you can as well eat this with a sauce tomato sauce but in this video i'm going to share with you how to prepare the beans and rice or rice and beans from the scratch step by step how to make this with red beans you can as well use this uh, use red beans to prepare your beans or you can as well use brown beans as I as I did I use Nigeria brown beans to prepare this rice and beans recipe come along with me let me show you how to make this from scratch step by step without missing everything if you've not liked this video please do not forget to hit the like button on this video and remember to share a Liami cooking recipe with your friends your family uh, I love to see your comments in the comment section leave down a comment in the comment section let me know what you think about our cooking so in today's video we are going to go straight in showing you can see how the beans and rice looks it looks perfect everything does not look stick together but it looks cooked perfectly cooked and easy this is an easy recipe let's go straight in preparing our rice and beans guys today i would love to share with you this beans and rice recipe or rice and beans how to prepare your rice and beans this recipe is very <coughs> i'm sorry about my mind. this recipe is very easy to prepare and is very fast but you can miss it out if you don't do it the right way so today i'm going to show you how to make beans and rice or rice and beans whichever you call it it's fine so i'm going to start this is a nigeria beans and this beans is called Uloyin. it's a brown beans and it's very delicious it doesn't need more more ingredients to make it sweet it's very sweet on its own naturally so i'm going to start picking it you can see these beans still have some dirt they still have some little rocks so i'll start picking everything after i pick it then i'll show you how to make it so yeah the reason i'm showing on clean beans is that uh, sometimes uh, this is how the beans comes uh, you might be lucky that uh, you buy a clean beans that someone will pick it for you so i'm going to show you how to pick it uh so if you find your beans like this if it's nigerian beans you are going to be patient while picking it this thing is very easy to do but you, you can miss it you can even have some rock in it so you just check it tr truly like this uh you can you can as well put it in a train to check it you can see everything is clean there's no stone and sometimes you can you can have some mist beans like this one this one is different for this one is not uloni beans so this is another beans and uh, we call this drum uh you can see this look this one will not get cooked on time so that's why i'm going to remove this i just want everything to look like this so this is what we are looking for in picking our beans so this is our uloni looks like if you cook this one it cook faster so but if you cook this this takes a long time to cook yeah this one can take you like let me as uh, give like 40, uh, 40 to uh, 50 minutes let me say an hour it can take you an hour to get cooked that's if you cook this but if you cook this this other type of it you can see there are two different beans if you cook this one you can cook it for two hours before it gets uh, soft and cook so that's why i'm going to sort it out uh I'm going to sort this out. Don't let me waste your time in sorting this out. But I just want to show you the difference. So after I sort it out, then I'm going to remove some little rock if I find a little rock from it. So after I sort it out, we start cooking. If you've not liked this video yet, do not forget to hit the like button. And remember to share a Liami recipe with your loved ones and your friends. And leave them a comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think about our recipe and this recipe. So you know in this channel we are... We are just like a family and we are friends. All your opinion is welcome. We we'll love to see your opinion in this channel. So let's hang out in the comment section. I will be there to answer any of your questions. So let me pick this and let, don't let me waste your time in talking. <coughs> 
So this is the outcome after I finish picking it. You can see everything is clean. So I'm going to clean this up. I'll wash it. Then we'll start cooking our beans. Uh, actually, I, I'm going to use a pressure cooker to cook my to prepare my beans. Uh, you can as well use your normal regular pot to prepare it. Doesn't matter. So, but I'm going to use a pressure cooker to prepare this. So let me wash this top. My beans has been washed, so I'm going to add some diced onions into it. This is an optional, you can make it optional, but I'm going to add diced onions into the beans. Then I'm going to add some uh, amount of water, just a, a little bit above the beans. So we are going to cook it after we add that. So let me add this into the beans. So if you've not subscribed to my channel, please do not forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you get updated every time I upload new videos. So this is the water. So it's time for us to cover it and put it in a, in a stove top. So I'm going to cover the pressure cooker now. Where is the cover? Where did I put the cover? Okay, now I'm going to put the cover. So I'm going to cover it. Why is this thing? I'm finding it out to cover. So let me just try and fix it. Then we are going to put it in the cooker for it to cook until it's a, about 90% cook. So, okay, we are done now. I'm, I, I'll just put it in the stove top. So I'm going to cook this for, for up to 30 minutes. Then we'll come back and check it. Waiting for the beans to get cooked uh we are still waiting for uh, it's about 20 minutes now that we are cooking our beans so we are going to wait for extra 20 minutes before adding our rice but before that i'm going to wash our rice so this is the last time you can see the water is clean so i'm just going to see it. So I'm going to wait for this to get dried as all the water in the rice we sieve out. So before adding it into our beans, but let's wait for our beans to get cooked. But let's go and check it if our beans is perfectly cooked before adding our beans and our rice. Uh, actually, there's a way you observe your beans before adding your rice. It's not as if a uh, cook, 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 but cook enough that it will take the rice and the beans to cook perfectly so not 100% cook like let me say they like 90% cook beans before adding your rice because many 10% we take the beans and the rice to cook together so let's go and check our beans if it's already 90% as I said so if you've not liked this video please do not forget to hit the like button it's encouraging me to do more of this recipe and share more recipe that i know with you keep on liking my video and keep on checking other recipe and don't don't forget to leave comment what you think your opinion is needed to uh either good or bad i want to know your opinion about our recipe and we are welcome we are open to any of your suggestions open your pressure cooker you need to be very careful yeah, so everything will not get splash on your body. So uh the one thing I normally do if I want to open my uh, pressure cooker to check what I'm cooking, it's better I remove it from the sto uh, stove top or I put up the light and I'm a uh, patient for the uh, pressure cooker to get calm before I open it so it will not pour my body. So I normally do that uh you don't just open it direct while it's on you on the stove top so you to, you will get hot if you do that there's no same way over it because when you are cooking with pressure cooker the pressure in the pot will open once you open it and everything can splash in your body so please be careful while you are cooking with pressure cooker so i'll open it i'll put switch off the lights uh i will up the uh, stove then I will wait for it to calm down before I open it. So, because we want to check our things. Our pressure cooker is open now. 
So I want to show you how the beans look after some uh, minutes that we have been cooking. It. You can see the water and the beans are in almost the same level. So I'm going to show you how the beans look like. See, this beans is cooked but not uh, up to 90%. You can see once I, all these are my bad habits. So it's very hot, don't mind me. So uh, this is how it looks. At this stage, you can add your rice to it, eat, and the beans will cook with the rice. Everything will come out perfectly. But before I do that, I'm going to add extra water. That extra water will be the thing to cook the rice and the beans. So I'm going to add extra water to it. Since I'm cooking two cup of a uh, parboiled rice. And the beans is one cup and a half. I'm going to add extra water. At this stage, I'm going to add some salt. I'm going to add some pinch of salt to sweet the taste. I uh, just add the pinch of salt that will sweet your taste. So I'm going to add some pinch of salt and I'm going to add some amount of cooking oil. You can as well add what's it called butter to this, but I'm going to add some cooking oil. Actually, when you cook your beans and rice, I rice some beans with cooking oil. Or butter it, it actually tastes nice so we are going to wait for this to get boiled before adding our rice so we are going to cover this up so I'll cover this up so uh, for it to let me say in five minutes time the water should be properly boiled and steam with the sauce and and I say sauces, the salt and the cooking oil. So before adding our what's it called, uh, our washed rice. So we are going to wait for this. And if you've not subscribed to my channel, please do not forget to subscribe. Share my recipe with your loved ones and your friends. Let them get to know our recipe and let them contribute to our channel. Uh, as I said on Olayemi Cooking China, we are not we are not just a subscriber, we are a family. So that's why I love you guys to give me your opinion about our recipe. And actually, most of my recipes basically Nigeria food. We like preparing our food, and actually, I'm still trying to introduce you to other recipes that I know, and I'm trying to introduce you to one of my local recipe. It's been longer I prepared that, but once I get the recipe ingredients complete, I'm going to share the recipe with you. It might be in a live video or it might be in record video. So I'm going to share the recipe with you when the time comes. Please do not forget to subscribe so you get updated when I open upload the video. So let's wait for this to boil for five minutes. So now, yeah, let's check our water. You can see it's boiling, so I'm going to add our washed rice into this. So I'm going to, mm, I'll start adding our washed rice. Then I'll give it in a gently stir. Uh, actually, I don't want my spoon to touch the uh, bottom because I don't want the food to get burned. So I will stir it gently so the rice and the beans will combine to cook together. So we are going to wait for this to cook for another 35 minutes. So after 35 minutes, we come and check this. Actually, I'm cooking this in the middle of it. So after 35 minutes, we come and check our our rice and beans. So we are going to cover this and allow it to cook. So
so now we are going to wait for 35 minutes before coming back have you checked order of my recipe please do not forget to check chicken pepper soup how to cook nigeria fried rice and how to cook nigeria jollof rice and i also have a recipe on how to cook nigeria egusi soup how to cook egusi soup and nigeria pop puff and nigeria buns please do not forget to check that out i have so many recipe on how to cook french toast without vanilla extract please do not forget to check the video out i'll put the link in the description below and I also put the link in the end screen. You can as well check that out or you can as well check up here. There will be a link up here for you to see more of our recipes. Let's wait for this to cook. So after 35 minutes, we are going to check our rice and beans. Oh my God, this really looks good. It looks perfectly cooked. The rice and beans is almost ready. Uh, we we are still hearing some sound of some liquid on that. That, that means there's some water in it. So I just want to show you how it looks. And it looks perfectly cooked and everything doesn't look sticky together. You can see the rice is ready. We just want to wait for a couple of minutes so everything will get dry. So if you've not liked this video yet please do not forget to hit the like button on this video and leave down a comment in the comment section let me know what you think about this rice and beans recipe and actually rice and beans is very easy to prepare you can as well cook uh, red beans actually i'm trying to share that with you some other time oh my god this is the outcome our rice and beans is ready our beans and rice is very easy it's an easy recipe to prepare so this is how it looks it looks very hot and it looks cooked everything look perfectly cooked and and nicely cooked so this is our rice and beans you can as well eat this with a sauce a tomato sauce i think i will share other recipe with you with a how i make easy rice and beans recipe with sauce i'll be sharing that with you some other time i just want to show you how to make rice and beans how easy it goes you can make this recipe without too much stress this step is very easy to prepare you can see everything is nicely cooked and this easy rice and beans recipe it only takes you uh one hour 30 minutes to prepare and here uh, and you can equally store it in the fridge uh, for other time so this is how to make your rice and beans you can see the beans is perfectly cooked and it looks soft and the rice look perfect look at the color look at the combination and oh my god this look perfect do not forget to hit the like button and you can as well check other of our recipe how to cook nigeria egosi soup shrimp sauce and rice and nigeria pop up this is the pop pop recipe do not forget to check that out and egg and potato uh, recipe do not forget to check that out and you can as well check how to cook jollof rice and how to cook fried rice all this recipe will be linked in the description below thanks so much for watching my video and please stay safe out there and i guess i will see you next i guess i will see you all in my next recipe